Hello. Yes. Welcome to my week 4 battle in the CBL um, so against Champ. Like What's his name again? Champaholic? Stank, yeah, Champaholics. Yeah. It's gonna be. It should be fun. Basically, my strategy here is Hazards and then Choice Bandits to Raptor Quick Attack. Which should do decent very well against this team. Other than the Ghost Dog, obviously. That's pretty much my pretty much my prep. Two special attackers, the slow bro should yeah, be so fine to take those on. Mostly, I do have some special defense on my iron hands and as well. And when I say some special defense, I mean I have 252 special defense, albeit it's not a special defense nature, but should be able to take a hit or two as well. And Dundoso should just wall up like every physical attacker on the team. Ramon. Okay, that's the Ndidi. Which I should be faster than, I believe. I'm just gonna put up rocks here. Okay, it's faster. Uh, I can't remember the speed to yours exactly. I think maybe Ndidi is naturally faster. Actually. Let's see. Uh, Yep, 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 I'm 86, and that's it. 95, I do get my rocks up though, so. I'm gonna switch here, because um, I could at least switch it in on the physical attack just to get my toxic spikes up later. What's the duration of the ability? This is the first time I've used the Sash Hazard lead. This should do nothing. Is this specs or something? I feel like okay, that's a crit, so probably not specs done. I think I'm just gonna no need to overpredict. I'm just gonna throw off a surf here. Was there no psychic drain, by the way? Okay, this is fine. I don't really care what it does, nothing should be able to do that as much damage to me, not even a Draco. I should live pretty comfortably. Oh no, it has defog. Oh, I, could, I should have just gone into my thing. But now at least... At least he can't defog again. So I guess that's fine. Although I'm not really sure I will be able to get hazards up again. Oh well, it is what it is. Even one toxic layer of toxic spikes would be fine, to be honest. It's not gonna be as effic effective for sweeping with the Straptor, but uh, I do have two rocky helmets, so I should be able to let those mods take some chip. Okay. I think I just go into Glamora here to get the, this back up. He can sword stance only once, but that's not gonna help because uh, my my Dundozo is unaware. Pretty fast-paced game so far, at least, which is necessary with the timer. I think I'm two one so far in this draft. Also, after losing week one, I picked up two. Well, last week was kind of... It went to down to timer, so... Not a true win. Okay, we do see a Terra here. What type? Alright, I can check out what type. It is. I can't even remember what type that is. Is that... What is that even? That's what you get for not playing this game. That's a Sacred Sword. Chien Pao. Okay, so that's one of the stabs. Uh, or is that... No, that's fighting, right? I don't think that should be allowed. Because we're only supposed to be able to choose one 
type, that's not the stamp. And the document says that should be ghost for this one in particular. Because that's definitely fighting, right? Yeah. That has to be banded fighting. So I'm just gonna go into gold and go here. It can't be anything other than banded fighting because then Dosa wouldn't take so much. Hmm. The most annoying thing here. I'm just gonna. Probably goes into Arcanine here. I, I was like, oh, we kicked, oh, we killed it, so we're good, and I was celebrating, and then we died to it. So I'm like, what? No, I think we broke it. Down. Arcanine is like the only good switch. Is it boots? It is not. Okay, good. That's good for me. Token. If he's could be like a special set with energy ball or something, which would be very good for him at this point. Because then it's, I'm just probably just gonna kill my dozo because it has its full physical bulk. But uh, you never know. I'm just gonna go into this. I see no reason why I should let Dozo die, even if it's pretty low. Because it can still tank a hit from like Pomot or probably Houndstone as well. So, regards basically. It's okay, I can share the fun. Okay, here comes Mr. Hands. That would be very helpful. Baby steps, bro. Baby steps. Takes no damage whatsoever. Rocky Helmet. Recoil. I have no reason to do anything other than Vault Switch. I can't really recover anything. Okay, that's annoying, but um... Guys, mostly supposed to take hits. And he can still do that quite well. <laughs> I think. I think, I think that I can go into Gold and Go again. It's pretty obvious that I'm Scarf. Unless he's Scarf on something, that should, should be fine. Listen to me, yeah. Everything is gonna get poisoned unless, because he doesn't have poison type, and unless his boots, things are just gonna get chipped away. Now, make it rain, I think, hits everything for neutral, other than Pomot, which... Uh... So 
This could obviously be Scarf. What? I can't even remember what the other ability is on this. I've never seen it, see it without Psychic Terrain. Is it Inner Focus or Synchronize? Probably. Goes for the Shadow Ball, could play. Doesn't quite... Oh, it gets a drop though, that's annoying. I think this is played like it's Scarf, so I'm just gonna go into Staraptor here. I don't really need HP on it either. either. Okay. Does make the double, that's a good play. Did predict my star after probably. Honestly, I feel like Pomo takes a lot of damage from this. Star after choice band Pomo. Quick attack. Adamant. Terra type normal. Okay, 53, 2. Ah, might as well just sack Dozo before going into hands at this point. The thing is that the toxic spikes. He's just putting everything he has on a timer. Double shock. Is that a... Yeah. Is that a physical contact move? Yeah, it is. I think we're all intended to pop all full as soon as the first pack spawns, and that's everyone. Just go in back into Mr. Hands. Yeah, and I can just slow volt switch. Could have. Yes. Oh, right. I forgot about that thing. Right That's right. very annoying. I completely forgot that was a thing. And he has to bury. Okay. The, the thing is, we'll use it there. And then we That's um, it super else. annoying. We'll move it later on. Let's see. Guessing it brings back Neuvern to life, probably. Unagi, I can't remember if that was no Neuvern. Oh, it's Volt Absorb. Oh, fuck, I'm so stupid. Oh my god. I deserve nothing. Why did I forget that that was like Volt Absorb? I'm so, 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 so stupid. Okay. No reason to panic just yet. I'm just gonna Drain Punch. All right, you can do that again. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. What was the other thing that was died? That died before? Arcanine, right. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. I do you think? Hmm. Yeah, this is. This is rough. I guess Arcanine could be a problem when it's not toxic, but I think everything else is already... Oh, it just brings out this. I uh, might wonder if he makes a double here. I think I go into you. I feel like it would double. That's the way it's been playing already. No double. I 
I think I make it rain. Ramon goes down. That's okay. I mean, that's okay. That's okay. That's amazing. I'm just thinking. Neuburn. How much would a minus one make it rain do? 51 to 60 to Neuburn. If it brings it out, it should die. So that's good for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna go for it. I think it's Unless it's Scarf. I mean, it could be very bulky, no. Nice. Good, good, good. <laughs> then we are Gucci. I'm glad my slightly more yeah, aggressive no play paid off instead of just going for the safe switch at the time. Honestly, I don't see what's stopping me from just sweeping with close combat now. As far as I remember, everything is pretty low on his team. Oh, there's the Houndstone, obviously. That, that could be a problem. Yeah. That's the guy. But he can't be faster than me. Just can't. Because the Houndstone is pretty slow, right? It's fine. Yeah, it's, it's almost 68. And I am. 137. Fastest he could be is 132. Yeah. So we're all, all good. Or maybe he didn't take any damage from. Am I faster? What's the Raptor? 146. So I could just go into the Raptor too. I don't need to go into Golden Go, but I will. Golden Go, Dazzling Gleam. What does that do? Not enough. Yeah, I guess I just go for make it rain again. Why not? Oh, it has shadow sneak. I didn't even know it got that, but it's fine because I'm a bulky boy. A bulky, bulky boy. Kill the dog. And we are still faster than anything that comes in because we're scarfed. Who is this again? Chen Pao. I guess it might have Sucker Punch. But I don't care. Ice Shard. Okay. Oh, 
please don't timer stall me now, that would be so annoying. Although I think he also, also only has two months remaining. Right? Yep. I'm just gonna go for my quick attack. And we are should be go good to win. I mean, I win on HP either way. If he doesn't do anything. Because both of his mods are low and mine have full HP. So, it should be fine. Right? Yes. I mean, my battle plan kind of worked out. Although I completely forgot about Revival Blessing and played pretty poorly against the Palmont overall. Yeah, that's not gonna do enough. Quick attack, you should knock this out. I don't even know if. Uh, oh. I, guess I, I think the right. ideal play is actually to go into Slow King here, but it doesn't matter because the time is out. Uh, I do win though. Fucking timer, so annoying. I feel like I've been playing quite aggressively in all my games since still two of them have gone to timer. So I really don't. doesn't feel that good. Oh well, we would have. I'm pretty sure we would have won that because Arcanine. Yeah, no way, no way. It doesn't do like, no. Yeah, it does enough damage, and then there's the poison tick. So yeah, I feel like it would be. We would definitely have won either way. But oh well, what can you do with the timer? I hope they decide to fix it eventually. But well, it's not a problem according to them, I guess. But thanks for watching, and I will be back next week with another battle, hopefully. So, until then, see ya!